People are on looking how we treat ourselves and how we show up in the world and that is being reflected back to us. So people respect people who respect themselves. Hey guys, it's licensed therapist Kim Eagle and in this video I am going to speak to self-respect. The biggest thing that I want to say is the respect that you have for yourself is going to be reflected back to you by how people treat you. So if you have high self-respect, you will get back high self-respect from other people. I want you to focus and look at areas such as your physical health, your mental wellness, and your emotional wellness. It's easy to do a quick inventory and think that you're doing great and that you have a lot of self-respect. But if you really look at what you're literally digesting physically and emotionally, what you feed yourself, how you treat yourself, what your inner talk is saying, what your boundaries are with other people, all of those things are ways that we are respecting ourselves, and it's being communicated without words. Our actions and how we treat ourselves is giving off energy and people are on looking how we treat ourselves and how we show up in the world and that is being reflected back to us. People respect people who respect themselves. And again, if you just keep your eye out on how you are treating yourself, what you're saying to yourself via your inner talk, how you're treating yourself physically, and what you are accepting from your relationships, how are your boundaries? Are your boundaries considering your needs and wants? Are you actively engaging in things that are healthy for you? Are you allowing people to mow you over with their schedule? Are you doing what you think other people want you to do? Or are you really honoring your needs and wants and making clear your boundaries? Because that's you treating yourself with a lot of kindness and respect. I can say it in so many different ways, but to keep it simple, your level of self-respect that you have for yourself is going to absolutely align with the self-respect that you get from other people. That's why often when you see someone that's kind of running around with their head cut off, just like trying to be that person for everyone, those are the people as kind as their gestures are to do everything for everybody. That's not respectful because they're not being respectful of themselves when they're not factoring in what they really need and want. That's why those people often get walked over or are, you know, quote unquote doormats. It's because people don't respect people at the end of the day that are not factoring in their needs and wants and taking good care of themselves. Please treat yourself like a freaking queen or king. Please do, because if you do, you will get that same respect. That's not to say be boastful and be unkind to other people, but you deserve an abundance of self-respect. Treat yourself respectfully and you will get respect back. That's the biggest thing I can say to you. So if you guys are enjoying these videos, feel free to give me a subscribe and thank you for listening and respect yourself. Cool.